What's up you guys, it's Valley Vaughn and I'm back with some favorites from Sephora. The sale is going on. I know I'm a little bit late. You probably already made your purchases, but if you haven't purchased these things, I'm here to let you know that I tried them. They are some of my favorite products and I'll be picking up these products during the Sephora sale that we wait patiently all year to indulge in. So if you love beauty, if you love fragrance, if you love all of the luxurious things of life that just makes us feel so girly and so renewed and soft girl lifestyle, make sure you subscribe, like this video, and let me know what did you already pick up from the Sephora sale? Is there anything else you have your eye on? Hopefully it's not sold out because that's the main thing. People really purchase things very quickly during the sale. So let's hop right in because it's going to be a long video. Grab you a little snack, grab yourself a drink, and let's get right in. I have a few different categories. I have some skincare favorites, I have some hair care favorites, I have makeup of course, and then perfume or fragrance. So let's get right into it, okay? Let's start with skincare because this is becoming, this used to be like my least favorite category as far as beauty, but it's now one of my favorites because I just feel like if you don't have a nice base to start with, your makeup's not gonna look as good as it could. So here's a few things that I've been loving in my collection. So the first thing is from Kiehl's. This is their Rare Earth Deep Pore Cleansing Mask. I talked about this on my Instagram. If you're not following, it's Valley Vine the Perfume Dawn on Instagram. There's so many clay mask on the market. I think the most popular one is from Aztec. I think that's the name of it, but this one is my favorite by far. It does an amazing job of what I notice. I've been wearing a lot of makeup, which I do, and I really need to cleanse my pores. My skin's looking dull and it just needs like a reset, a refresh. This is the mask that I put on. It doesn't dry my skin too much, which I noticed from a lot of other masks. So that's what I really like, but it does a great job of bringing out those impurities and bringing all of the dirt out of my pores. I feel like I could just start fresh, have that clear glowing skin. Another thing I have to note is this one, it will cause a few breakouts if you have a lot of gunk in your skin, but it's just breakouts that were already gonna happen. It just happens faster because you're bringing all that dirt out of your pores. But I love this. As you can see, I've been using it and I haven't had that many breakouts. Like as much as I wear makeup, it's been doing the job. So definitely check this out. While we're talking about Kiehl's, I do have another favorite Kiehl's product. This is their truly targeted acne clearing solution. So when we were just talking about acne, there's very few, there is so few acne remedies I've noticed. Like when you actually get a spot, there's only two products that really work in my opinion. It's the Clinique spot treatment, the gel one, and this one. These are the only ones. It's more of like liquid. This one has like an eyedropper. It's a liquid, but I'm telling you, when you put this on your pimple overnight, wake up and the pimple is gone. Like I'm shocked. It's very, very, very effective. And it's actually so thin that you can like put it on if you have a pimple and still put makeup over it. And it doesn't look like weird or patchy or anything like that. So really, really love this one. I'll definitely be repurchasing because as you can see, there's like a lot gone. I don't know if you can see it's like down here. I'm halfway done. This is a really, really good acne treatment. And I take this with me whenever I go on vacation because some for some reason I always break out when I'm on vacation, but this helps me. Also speaking about the health of our skin, I love products from Youth to the People. I will be purchasing their face cleanser, super clean kale cleanser, whatever it's called. I love that product. I ran out. I'm going to purchase it this, this Sephora sale. But I also recommend if you guys wear a lot of makeup like me, definitely invest in a cleansing balm. This one is their Super Berry Dream Cleansing Balm. It has prickle pear, hyaluronic, hyaluronic acid, and flash melting formula. Ooh, girl, I read that too fast. I thought it said flash melting formula. I was like, ah! No, it has a flash melting formula. Mm which it does. Okay, I don't wanna scare you. But literally, if I have like, I have on a lot of makeup today, so I'll be using this product. The way it, the consistency is, it's kind of similar to almost like a waxy. I don't know if you guys have ever used that product, like beeswax. I used to use it when I wear my hair natural, but it's like a hard waxy consistency and then you put it in your hands, it heats up immediately and it turns into an oil and takes all of your makeup off. The most difficult things, glitter, it's all gone. So then when you go in, with your face wash it's not like you're just taking your makeup off and like leaving residue it's a really really effective product and of course very very gentle as well so i love using this whenever i have a lot of makeup on and again today will be one of those days <laughs> last skincare product i want to talk about is from 
Of course, this is the Indigo Overnight Repair. I always used to feel, okay, so I'm an oily girl. I always battle the oil. I thought I was going to be left in my teenage years. Of course not. But for that reason, I never thought I needed a moisturizer. I do. And I specifically love this one from Tatcha. Even though it's super pricey, it's worth it because it's so lightweight. It's like it's featherweight, you guys. It's so lightweight. It absorbs into the skin so quickly. And it just leaves like your skin looking very hydrated. Almost like you put a serum on your face and I just wake up and I feel like my face looks rejuvenated. It looks youthful, it looks plump, and I just feel like I don't even need makeup. So that's why I really, really like this product. It is pricey, but if it's gonna help me wear less makeup when I go to the gym and feel more confident, then I will invest in a product like that. And again, we're getting back to just having beautiful skin, okay? So that's it for the skincare. Let's hop over to our makeup products. Okay, so I have quite a few suggestions for the base, which is everything. I feel like if you have a nice base, it's like foundation, powder, concealer, all those sorts of things and everything just comes together easily. So for the base, I love this powder from Huda Beauty. It is like iconic to me. I have to use it all the time. I just feel like it blurs. I haven't tried the new baking powder that they have on the market, but I might try that as well. But yeah, this is just the Banana Bread Easy Bake Loose Baking Setting Powder. I use this all the time underneath my eyes to prevent creasing, which is helping me a lot because I have a lot of creasing underneath the eyes. Again, to help with the oiliness. And I love this shade as well. It's, it's like a light yellow shade and it's perfect for my skin tone. I've repurchased this so many times. I don't need to purchase it this time. I don't think, I think I have a good amount. Probably next spring I'll have to get it, but yeah. Love this, it's wonderful. The only second best is like the Fit Me, but it's just, it's not as good as this. Sorry. Huda Beauty knows how to make long lasting makeup. Okay, as far as foundations, I am really, really into medium to full coverage because my skin's acting appropriately right now. Medium to full coverage, satin radiant sort of a finish. So I really, really love this from NARS. I am in the shade Tahoe. This is the natural radiant long wear foundation. Um, you're supposed to shake it before you use it. A lot of people say that it's like a little bit patchy on them for some reason, I don't know why. For me, this is beautiful. It matches my skin tone perfectly. I think they got the perfect mix of warm, like yellow golden undertones in neutral, which is what I am. And usually they go way too yellow or way too neutral. This is like the perfect shade for me. So I love this. Um, and again, it doesn't look too cakey. It does cover pretty well, but it doesn't look too cakey. So I love that. I just love NARS products in general. But if you're looking for a foundation, this is iconic. I know everyone always uses it for a good reason. I hope they never, never, never change up their shade range or never and never change up the formula. And then I have two concealers that I use all the time. I actually use them together. So that's one thing that speaks to the quality of these concealers. The fact that you can actually blend them together, beautiful. The first one is going to be when I want strict full coverage. This of course is the Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. This is super coverage. This is for when I have a photo shoot I have to do, if I have to be on camera, if I take pictures, if I have to go to an event, anything to where I really, really need to look good and cover up all of my imperfections, then I definitely like to use this concealer. I am in the shade Golden Beige. This is like, just matches my skin tone pretty much. So it's not highlighting, but it's more so concealing for me. So love this concealer. Um, again, a good amount of here, so I don't need to repurchase it at the moment. And then when I want to brighten, or if I have like more of like a lighter day with my concealer or my makeup, then I do love the rare beauty one and i'm actually so sick i have i bought the rare beauty liquid blush i have no idea where that blush is i'm sick i've been searching for it i have no idea i feel like i left it in a purse i don't know which purse it's in maybe it's in a drawer <sighs> Pray for me, y'all. I want to find that liquid blush. I really loved it. But at the moment, all I have is the Rare Beauty Concealer. And in this, I'm in the shade 320W. So a warm shade, um, kind of like a medium shade. But yeah, really, really love this one. So a tad bit brighter than my actual skin tone, but that's fine. I feel like these concealers are like light to medium coverage, but they do a good job of like melting into the skin. So you don't have to have your exact skin tone. For me, that's what I noticed when I was playing around in the store and when I picked up this concealer. So love this one. Love all of Rare Beauty actually. And I would love to find that liquid blush. Okay, I have three lip products that I am swearing by. The first two, I mean, everyone knows. Everyone knows. Rihanna, 
you did your thing with these Fenty Heat lip gloss. I'm a lip gloss girl. I've, you would never catch me in a lipstick. That's not me. I'm on lip gloss today. I think I'll be 80 years old wearing lip gloss. I'm just a lip gloss girl. And I love these heat plumping lip glosses. If you don't know the heat lip glosses from Rihanna's Fenty brand, that just means that they're actually plumping. The one that's actually so beautiful and I think perfect for the fall happens to be the hot chocolate. Love that one. But for every day, I'm upset. I'm obsessed with the glass slipper heat so it's pumping it's clear it's just like just slap on and run out the door i'm getting back into pilates you guys so this is probably going to be my go-to because i'm going to go for like a natural clean girl look but yeah the gloss bombs are wonderful 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 to me actually i'm gonna put this one right now this is the hot chocolate mm. isn't that so cute as you can see it's like not dark brown i was afraid when i saw this packaging but yeah that's so cute and perfect for the fall so cute if you don't want to spend your coins on the rihanna gloss bomb heat then you can go ahead and get the sephora plumping lip gloss it's not as plumping like your lips aren't going to be as inflated but the color range that they have is so beautiful i love this one i think this is the number two outrageous shade is the most beautiful nude mauve tone and it just goes with everything it just pulls every look together it's probably my favorite nude of all time yeah their plumping lip glosses from the sephora brand are on point and of course you know that with the sephora brand during the sale their actual brand is 30 percent off and everything else it goes by tiers but this is a great time to stock up on some sephora products and they actually have some gems so check them out okay the last two makeup products are going to be from a brand that i feel like is so under rated it is literally criminal this is from merit beauty the first one is going to be a nice flush blush like literally i wish i could show you guys how it looks on the skin it literally just looks like you've been running and your cheeks are red or if you just like have i don't i don't even know it's like it's like the most beautiful natural flesh tone blush this is in the shade for cinnamon and it is so beautiful it is glossy it is natural you can use it actually as an all-around makeup uh, shade but this is their flush balm and it is so pretty it's my most favorite go-to product it's buildable you can use it on those days where you don't really want to show where you don't want to wear a lot of makeup but look at that beautiful shade it is like an orangey peach burgundy tone perfect for fall and literally you just put this on your cheeks put it on a little concealer perfect for the gym so definitely check out mirror beauty they're all about having your natural look but just enhancing it so i love that and it just blends in so beautifully just look at it. it's buildable and it never looks like too much like you never look like a clown so easy to look like a clown with blush but this one no the other product from mirror beauty that i'm obsessed with happens to be actually it's a new launch so this is the first time they're launching eyeshadows and this is their solo shadow in rune and again with the natural look you just put like a small swipe on your eyelid and then you have like this beautiful natural brown bronzy almost like a brown light smoky eye but just it's so beautiful oh i'm obsessed look at this it's like the most easy they're the easiest products to use they're the easiest products to apply and whenever I go on vacation I love to take their products because it's just so easy to apply you don't even need any brushes that's how the eyeshadow looks very buildable and you just make beautiful brown smoky eyes so I love Vera products check out all their products even their foundations I'm trying to limit it to two but I really really love all their foundation sticks I love their eyebrow gel that just gives you a little bit more volume in your brows all the products are amazing check them out Merit Beauty and definitely check them out during the sale Okay, now for hair care, I only have two products. Um, I actually use these products on both my natural hair and my units. So that's something to know. Really, really good stuff. Really, right, lately, I have been into hair oils and something to add some sheen, some sheen, some shine, some moisture to the hair. I feel like dry hair is so... Ugh. Like your hair has to have some shine to it. So I have two products. The first one is from the brand called Javen. Um, Jonathan Van Nance. I think that's his name from the Queer Eye for the Straight Guy. He has a hair care line. Of course, he is a celebrity hairstylist. And these shine drops are amazing. You just add like a little pea drop in your hands. I actually did it today because I felt like this hair looks very dry. Work it through and it just has a beautiful shine. It's not greasy. It doesn't weigh the hair down. It just adds that beautiful moisturizing shine and nothing more. More and nothing less so love this product again this is the javen complete nourishing shine drops it takes 
the smallest amount and it really makes a difference this brand is vegan um you do apply it to dry hair and it's just a silky silicone free um oil and it adds an instant gloss but it doesn't add any weight to the hair so you're still gonna have that balance that volume but you're just gonna have some some sheen honey so i love this one again i use this on my natural hair and i use it on my units if i want something that has a little bit more oil but still not like greasy this oil from the brand called bread is amazing this is their hair oil their everyday gloss and it is for the curly girls it's for curly types 3a through 4c again if you want to add some moisture to the hair it is wonderful but it doesn't weigh the hair down so love this one and honestly doesn't this packaging look like art like i actually just wanted this for the packaging but the product inside say magnifique as well so those are two products from hair care i definitely suggest you checking out and it brings us to our favorite category which is perfume fragrance i narrowed it down just to three fragrances something for everyone that i think you should check out definitely keep your eye on and i think this is a perfect season for it as well the first one is going to be from killian this launched maybe like two years ago maybe more maybe three or four actually it's been a minute but i love this scent i cannot rave about it enough i love getting people to smell this fragrance and seeing their reaction because they're always as obsessed as me and they're like oh my god i have to buy it i have to buy it i have to buy it yes you have to buy it okay if you don't have in this if you don't have this in your collection it's the by killian or actually it's killian angel share it smells like a sticky cinnamon donut apple crisp it, it smells like a decadent dessert it's a little bit boozy i got ate up for another video i didn't say that i thought it was like a powerhouse fragrance it's not like a weak fragrance at all people are gonna smell this on you slightly spicy oh my god i just i actually i just went out to dinner you guys and i had a dutch apple pie for dessert it's giving dutch apple pie with cinnamon on top you can definitely smell this it has good sillage it has good performance it has this beautiful trail that it's gonna leave behind you as you're walking around people are gonna be running behind you you trying to eat you up thinking about apple pie the way i am right now but it is very beautiful and the way the reason why i don't say it's a powerhouse because powerhouse for me actually can be a negative like it enters the room before you now this enters the room with you and it just has this beautiful enveloping cloud of gourmand deliciousness around you it's so pretty it's wonderful for this festive season halloween's girl halloween is pretty much over so we're in the festive holiday season and this is the perfect scent to kick off the holidays the fall the winter it's boozy it's beautiful if anything just get it because it looks beautiful on your vanity and i might be keeping my eye on the other ones in the collection because i love it nothing else in my collection is like it it's unique it performs and it smells amazing what more do you want what more do you want from me okay okay the next one that we have this is actually from glossier i was so happy i was so happy when they brought glossier to sephora well because we can get in on those sales girl and everyone can know about glossier glossier is actually that girl millennials know but this is their fragrance they actually they're offering in the larger size now so this is glossier you this is their only fragrance they offer it in a solid form and this 1.7 fluid ounce and now double the size in a 3.4 fluid ounce if you've never smelled this what are you doing but now if you've never smelled this it is a musky floral skin scent it's very clean it's very luxurious soap vibes but mostly it's just a musky scent it smells like your scent but better thus the name you i definitely like to layer this with other fragrances because something about musky fragrances it just makes the other scent that you're wearing even stronger so i love that but if you just want a clean vibe fragrance something to wear to pilates wear to the gym wear running errands nothing too strong this is the one for you it's a great everyday scent it's a great signature scent again it's not super unique you're not going to stand out but people are just going to be like you smell good that's all they're going to say you're going to smell like you and this is from glossy and then the last product i'm going to share with you guys actually from kelly it's their newest launch i have been loving wearing this fragrance it has that oomph it has that va -va boom it's giving just a carabin it's very sexy it's definitely date night vibes um and it should be because of the name this is kelly oodgasm their latest launch they released four new fragrances all centering around the beautiful oud scent and this one is rose oud this is absolutely my favorite from the launch it has so many beautiful notes in there it has lemon it has geranium bulgarian rose
Rose, Vanilla, Madagascar, it has Cashmere Wood, and of course it has Oud. It is a very sexy, floral, woody, spicy, velvety kind of a scent. And it just definitely like pulls you in. It's very, very, very sultry, very sexy. So if you're that kind of a girl, definitely check out this one. Again, it's new from Cali, and the whole fragrance line is very nice. Can't wait till they get it at Sephora so people can smell it in person, but take my word, it's beautiful. But okay, those are some of the things I recommend. If your cart is, <laughs> is still has some things in it, you might want to add some of those to your cart and pick them up before the sale is over. Again, they're things that I love. I'm going to run into the store and once I have my haul, make sure you subscribe so you can see where I pick up from the Sephora sale. And let me know again, what did you pick up? And I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.